Hey everyone, Burn here from Burnstone TV Gaming back with an Albion Online video and today I'm going to show you how I made 400,000 silver with just rough logs and I'm also going to teach you how I did it. Alright, first why should you care about rough logs and why are they so profitable in this game? So rough logs are used in construction and upgrading buildings in personal islands and guild islands. Now for someone who just spent millions and millions of silver buying and upgrading their islands, they don't really care much about the price of rough logs in order for them to construct the buildings that they want to. They usually just buy them at whatever price it is available in the market and don't really put in like buy orders in order to save a couple of thousands just with rough logs. With that comes an opportunity for us to make a ton of silver in this game. So the first thing that you want to do is to scout the market where you can buy uh, rough logs for the lowest amount and where you can sell them for the highest amount. Now don't worry, I will tell you where to buy and sell these rough logs, but if you want to maybe create more opportunity for you, what you can do is like take off all of your gear and go to the journeyman, go to each city and take note of the prices, the buy orders and the sell orders for each CD for rough logs. So that's how you can do it. Most of the time you can buy rough logs the cheapest in Limhurst because you know the city is just surrounded with rough logs. You can buy them cheapest in uh, Limhurst and usually sell them with the highest profit either in Bridgewatch or in Martlock. In this example, I actually saw an opportunity to double whatever I invest in in the rough logs buying from Limhurst and selling in Martlock. So the first thing that you want to do is put in your buy orders in Limhurst. Now right here I did buy a lot for 10 silver each and I'm going to sell it in Martlock for 22 silver each. So that is a lot of profit with just rough logs. So after you put in your buy orders, you can basically do whatever you want to do while waiting. So do dungeons, gather, or whatever you do normally in Albion Online. And after several hours, depending on the market, you can come back to Limhurst and collect all of your rough locks. When transferring a lot of raw materials, there are three things that you need to do in order to increase your efficiency per travel. Alright, so the first thing that you want to do is get a transport mount. What I'm using right now is a tier A transport ox, but you can basically use any um, transport mount that you have currently in your inventory. That should uh, work as well as uh, any. And the second thing that you want to do since we are transferring rough logs is buy a tier 4 lumberjack backpack. Now this backpack will decrease the weight of uh, rough logs by 30% so meaning you can carry more uh, per travel. And another thing that you want to get is a pork pie. Pork pie increases your overall carrying capacity by another 30% so increasing basically the quantity that you can carry per trip. For this specific mount, I was able to put in around 36,000 rough logs with just one trip and not going over 100%. That's actually an important note. You don't want to go over 100% and be slowed down because of that. Because the travel from Limhurst to Martlock is very long. It did take me around 15 minutes overall travel time from Limhurst to Martlock. So you don't want to extend that because it will just be you know a boring trip from you know one place to another so after 15 minutes of just basically traveling across the map i was able to reach smart log and was able to sell the rough logs for 22 silver each that gave me around 402,000 uh, profit that is excluding the set of fee from the buy order and the sell order of course uh, excluding the tax as well so with just around 20 minutes of active effort in buying and selling and transporting all of these rough logs so I was able to make 402,000 silver and I only invested around 365. So overall I have more than doubled what I have invested with in just 20 minutes and it's a very efficient way to make a lot of silver in Albion Online and the demand actually for rough logs is sort of uh, consistent there are a lot of rough logs being traded back and forth every single hour so you just have to be 
sort of patient with the buy orders that you have put in and know that it will be filled up after a couple of hours and you can go travel and get a lot of uh, silver in return for basically just transporting resources from one city to another all right so that is the video guys hope you enjoyed hope you uh, follow these steps and get the same results as i did make sure to subscribe for more videos like this one and i'll see you guys next time peace